Thank you so much, Craig. And we are in the kitchen talking healthy, tasty lunches with a little blast of fun, because that's really important. Because if you think about it, Americans actually spend over $1,000 each eating out during lunch. That's Not crazy. A, yeah, it's a lot of money, but it also can add to your waistline. That's why it's very important to try to learn to pack your lunch. Joining us is registered dietitian and nutritionist, Amy jamison Patana. Thank you so much for coming on the show. My pleasure. Hi, Amy. Hi. So let's talk about the benefits. There are a lot of benefits of packing your own lunch. There really are. I mean, not only does it save your wallet, because as you mentioned, $1,000 yeah, a year. Which is crazy. Yeah. yeah, so it also helps your waistline. What we know is, is if you are packing your own lunch, you have much more control over what you're eating and how much you're eating, so you can really do a better job of maintaining a healthy weight. So what food groups do you like to focus on? So I try to keep it simple for my clients, and we talk about just keeping a couple things in the lunchbox. Okay. A lean protein, a 100% whole grain product, a fruit, a vegetable, and some type of a dairy or high calcium source. Okay. So when I talk to my clients, I talk about how much to put in. So I like the palm of your hand because mm. it's simple. <laughs> so you do a palm of fruit, a palm of vegetables, a palm of whole grains, a palm of lean protein, and a cup of milk, and that's a perfect healthy lunch. I'm glad I have a very large hand. <laughs> yeah, I'm you joking, get little, I you really get do. So tell us about these Applegate packages, because uh, I mean, just in these packages, I'm about to tear this open. Absolutely, I'm working with Applegate because they offer a lot of good nutrition that I feel really good about offering my family as a registered dietitian and a mom. Applegate products have no GMOs, no antibiotics ever, oh, good. and they also are products made from animals that were humanely raised. So that's really important mm -hmm. to me that we're really offering good products in a good manner that's good for our health. Why don't you tell us about some of the recipes that okay. you've prepared today? Yes, I love super fun, super easy things, and my first recipe today is the Easy Peasy Lunch Kebabs. My family loved this one. We used the Applegate, black forest ham, the mm -hmm. Applegate roasted turkey breast, and I put it on skewers with some cucumber slices, some grapes, some pineapple, some cheddar cheese, and some cherry tomatoes, and isn't that fun? It's really fun. Yeah, it's really nice. <laughs> I need... There's the large palm. <laughs> <laughs> no, right. I need some ideas, and this is a great one. And you know what? <laughs> kids like things that are different, right? right? They like something that's a little unique. My so kids it's... are so over peanut butter and jelly, like they right. don't even want to look at them. And isn't this wow. bright and fun and colorful and nutritious? It is. So that's a great and product delicious, to delicious, by the way. Oh, good. I'm glad yeah, you like it. Yeah, I mean, what's it. not to like? All right. This is really pretty. Yes, and my second option is a Mediterranean turkey sandwich with a twist. And we know a Mediterranean diet is has been shown to reduce the risk of heart disease, diabetes, and cancer. Mm -hmm. So I put a lot of great products on this sandwich. I use the Applegate roasted turkey breast along with some hummus and some sliced cucumbers, some Kalamata olives, not Michael's favorite, mm. uh, some cherry tomatoes, and a little bit of feta cheese. And I put it on a garlic ciabatta bread. Ooh. And that it's just good. lovely. It's got a really, really nice taste to it. She and I both have picky eaters mm -hmm. for kids. How do we make these kids, how do we convince them or how do we, um, <laughs> right? You know, I don't want to say lie to them, but how? <laughs> well, how, how do we sneak fruits and veggies? How in? are we sneaky? You know, we really try to be creative and make it fun. Like I said, I try to really engage my family in the process as well. And like I said, keeping it colorful, keeping it fun. Yeah. I love a lot of the products, like the cherry tomatoes, because the other thing is, cherry tomatoes are very easy to pick up, and they're bright and they're colorful, and they're good for little fingers. And it's just a way to try to get some nutrition and in some creative ways if fruits and vegetables are not something that they're getting all of their diet in. Okay. Applegate.com is where you can learn more about all these delicious uh, items. It's delicious. Thank, Thank you, you very Amy. Much Thank for you. On the show. All right. When we